Hello and welcome to my channel. I'm Kim with Pink Squirrel Studios and I have a Dollar Tree haul for you today. So let me get started. This is part of my traveling Dollar Tree series if you've seen any of those um, where I am traveling through the entire state of Iowa hitting every single Dollar Tree and it's been a lot of fun. So I went to, let's see, this one was in Newton, Iowa. So if you're not familiar with Iowa, um, Newton, Iowa is home to, or used to be home to, uh, Maytag, uh, which is not there anymore. Um, the plant moved to, I don't know, probably Mexico. I don't, I don't remember where it moved to, but anyway, it's not there anymore. Um, and it is also home to the Iowa Speedway. So, um, anyway, so that's a little information about Newton, Iowa. Uh, let's see, I spent 32.10 there. I didn't see a plus section, so I was kind of surprised by that. So let's go ahead and get started. Picked up uh, this Halloween decor, these little broomsticks. And I don't think, they don't say that they're scented, um, but I might put some scents on them and then hang them up. We'll see. Okay, then I found these notepads. I've seen some of these before. They've got several different options to choose from, but this one is the one that spoke to me. It's got eight little notepads, and that's what it looks like. So I want to use these in my junk journal. So that's what I got those for. Okay, creepy cloth um, So I in, the, in black. So I got this just for some decorating fun and you know I don't know I might even use some of this in my junk journal too I mean why not it's 30 inches by 72 inches I found if you saw my last haul um, I found a, a composition notebook and it had this little guy on it and when I saw this little pencil case I couldn't help but pick it up I just, I just think that he's adorable, so I grabbed that. All right, I got several, let's see here. I picked up several new sticker sets. Um, this one, it's got a whole bunch of homey type ones. Um, it's got one that says Coffee Bar, This Is Us, Our Nest, Be Still. I hope I don't already have this one, um, but if I do, that's okay. I can find other places to use it. This one, uh, stickers, so I like this. These are foil stickers. I thought they were really pretty. I've got different lights on here, so hopefully that's not interfering um, with these images. Um, and I also got this sticker set. This one I'm positive I don't have. All right. Did that do it for the stickers? Yeah, it did. Okay. Oh, well, I, I got this window cling. So I'll grab or show you this one. And that is also for my junk journal. So I found, oops, here's one more sticker set. So I found these. I didn't have this one before. I thought it was really pretty. So, and these are the puffy stickers. Okay, so now uh, I found several of the clear stamps. I was really excited to see these. Um, so this one has sentiments on it and these are the ones that it has. And then there's this one. And I got this one. So that was a lot of fun. Let's see, what else did I find? Oh, I found this um, this little candle holder. It is, and I've, I haven't seen this one before, but it's in the shape of a leaf and it's glass. But I thought that was really pretty. Perfect for fall. All right. And I found these alphabet beads and thought these could be a lot of fun to craft with to make bracelets or whatever out of 
these would be great for little kids to make, you know, their own jewelry. So I thought that was nice. I found, um, I was really excited to find these. So, um, this is a set for earrings. It's got, it's got some extra, it looks like some extra posts. Um, yeah, I thought this was great. So let me see, maybe you can see some a little bit better on the back. So this one is in silver. Then I also found that in, let's see, in gold. And I found bracelet and necklace. So um, it's got, it's got like the claw clasp. It's got, oh, let's see what else we have in here. It's got little, little itty bitty beads. Um, so anyway, I found this one. And I also found that in silver. I've got some jewelry that I have, uh, in, in fact, some earrings and some necklaces that I need to fix, and I I am so happy to find these. So that was a great find. I also found this um, little, it's an LED pillar candle. This is what it looks like in there. But I thought the pattern was kind of pretty, so I'm, I'm, anxious to try that put uh turn it on and see you know what it does with the space with those little uh cutouts in there and i saw some air dry clay this is from crafter square 24 hours drying time and you know what i haven't played with clay since i was in i don't even know how old i was the last time i played with clay but it just seemed i don't know it just seemed like something fun to play with so I grabbed some of that and I'll see what I can do with that. I also grabbed one of these. I bought one of these during my last haul and um, I can think of a few more uses for them. So I grabbed another one. Um, these are just so handy when you want to take, you know, whether it be, um, you know, if you're writing notes, if you're just whatever you're doing, um, you know, you can keep it confined in here, take it from table to table or desk to desk whatever it is and use it and you don't lose any pieces of it so I also found this and I thought this was really pretty I forgot to check the spelling let's see yes I think we're good here <laughs> to make sure they didn't mess anything up so family is forever and that's what this guy looked like so I grabbed that. I also grabbed another one of these. Um, and I, this is not the kind, there were some that I found over the summer that were kind of um, rounded at the bottom and also rounded at the top. This is the old style that they used to have. And the reason I bought this was to put all of my little, you know, jewelry pieces in it. I've also got some, uh, I've got a couple other packages of things that, um, from Dollar Tree that are for jewelry, um, that I bought months ago. And so they'll all fit nicely in here. So I thought that was something I could definitely use. And then I found this I was really surprised to find this. Crafter Square Fusible Interfacing, heavyweight, great for jackets and waistbands, sewable, machine washable, non-woven poly blend, 20 inches by one yard. So this is what the package looks like. And then in the back, it's got all the instructions. Never seen this at Dollar Tree. That is such an incredible value. I was really, really surprised to see this. So uh, super excited to see that. Anyway, that will do it for today's haul. I've got another one. Uh, I also traveled to Grinnell, Iowa and picked up some things there. And so I haven't filmed that one yet, but I will hopefully soon. And uh, this one, of course, will be uploaded first. 
So I wanted to mention if you have a YouTube channel and especially if you're like me and you're trying to get it off the ground, um, you know, please let me know in the comments. I am more than happy to um, subscribe to your channel. I love watching other people's channels. I love to watch, you know, especially if you're a, a DIYer, a Dollar Tree, or really any type of hauler. Um, I really enjoy watching those channels. So, you know, the more the merrier. So if you want to drop me a line, let me know. Or if you're interested in maybe doing a, a collab, that'd be great too. Just let me know. So that will do it for today. This is Kim from Pink Squirrel Studios signing off. I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.